as a teenager, enthralled by 70s science fiction. Simon Cox from Warwickshire has wanted to make his own blockbuster. Well, now he's finally realised his dream, writing and directing his own film called Invasion Planet Earth. Despite having a tiny budget, the movie's been shown in mainstream cinemas, and in it, he manages to blow up Birmingham. Bob Hockenauer reports. Well, it's a pretty peaceful winter's day here in Birmingham's Victoria Square. But not so long ago, it was absolute carnage. And here is the man responsible for bringing all that mayhem to the city. I'm sorry, I'm the guy that let aliens destroy Birmingham. It all happened in the movie Invasion Planet Earth, a 20-year labour of love for film editor Simon Cox from Nuneaton. It was ever since I first saw the original Star Wars back in 1978, you know, I was so moved when I, I saw this film and how all the kids reacted to it. I thought, I want to make a sci-fi movie, I want to make a movie like Star Wars one day. And so he did, appealing for extras online, then shooting the movie in Birmingham for a tiny fraction of a Hollywood budget. I had all the streets closed off and everything, we had all the lights. I had no idea actually how many people were going to turn up. And 900 people turned up at one point. It was incredible. And were they easy to control? They loved it. Yeah, they were, they were absolutely fine. They loved it and they were proper brummies and they just wanted to be part of this film. Simon learned how to do most of the special effects himself. Most of the film's cost was met through crowdfunding. Hollywood are great. I love Hollywood movies. But, but independent cinema needs to be given a chance. Invasion Planet Earth has been in selected cinemas, is available on DVD and to download. Age 54, Simon has finally fulfilled his childhood ambition. Bob Hockenall, BBC Midlands Today, Birmingham.